Hi everybody and welcome back to Autonauts 15 maybe? I'm Photon M, and we've got plenty on the docket for today so it's gonna be um, fun and exciting. I well, well, I was letting it run, so the stone recovered eventually. When I let it build fireplaces and chimneys, it busted the stone again, and then I ran out of spades, which caused the forest tree to collapse. Um, so then when the stone recovered again, but even by the time it had recovered, the forestry was still a complete mess. So I went ahead and made a few more stone houses, because I had plenty of stone by then, but no trees to... I mean, there are some planks in these, but um, compared to the stone, you know, it's nothing. So I just made those, um, and then finally this recovered, so then uh, we're good to go. But I also made the mistake of... the forestry was like, I was out of logs, but I had plenty of the supplies to make robots, so I made another batch of robots. But I wasn't... that was dumb, because the panels that go into the robots require a ton of planks, so it, the forestry took a long time to recover after I made that mistake. Um, but now we have a whole bunch of robots and it's fine. I mean, I was like cooking and, you know, I wasn't just sitting here, um, you know, waiting for it to recover. I did at one point run around the edges and uncover more of this uncovered territory because it looks bad in the recording to have this dark stuff. So. Um, so I did do that. So today, we've got several things that we're going to do. The first thing I'm going to do is make some bees for these empty beehives. So, um, chick wand maker. I'm pretty sure it's just five, it's called chicken wands in this mod, but I'm pretty sure it just needs five of those and we need the dirt. Make sure this is set to dirt. And, oh. And I have to set this to make the right kind of wand. So, these. Okay. And then I'm gonna also make some more. We're full on stone, so I gotta think. Every rough stone wand uses 11 stone. Because it's 10 for this plus 1 for the crude pick. Um, so that'll be 55 stone. Oh, I didn't say go. I thought I said go. But I didn't. So we'll make some more of that just because I want it. I want to have some in storage. And then... Um, so that's 55. I can make another cottage. Each cottage takes... 34, I think? It's 20 for these, for the chimney and fireplace, plus I think one stage of 10 stones and one stage of 4. So we'll just I'll just keep these going kind of while I have enough to make them. Okay, and then, then we also need, I really really need to get an egg to do the research for chickens. So I'm gonna have the turf digger dig this out and then I just need to put fencing around it. So let me do that real quick. I'll just fast forward on that one. Okay and I'm just gonna grab... oh I thought I had a whole bunch of this made. This I have made for the poncho area. Okay I don't have enough fence to hold in the chickens so... um. I'll make some more picket fence, I guess, because that'll be something new. I just need to put these... the ones that are already made over here so that I can queue up. So I like to do them in lines like this so it doesn't block their passage when they're coming in and out of this area. And I usually use 12 gates, although it's not necessary. Yeah. Chickens are getting a fancy fence. That's not going to be enough, but I'll do a little at a time, so it just I, so I have supplies to do other things. Once we get some of this um, stone stuff worked out, it's going to be so much easier. So I am going to program. I have some ideas. Um, so for 
By the way, uh, we need colonization because it gives us a skateboard, so we need toys. The other thing we're going to do is use the carts and wheelbarrows in this episode. Oh, oh, and I need a backpack. So I have an idea for the wheelbarrows. But first, a backpack. So here it is. Good backpack upgrade. We need, all we need is a box frame and the crude backpack that we're already wearing. So let's stick that in there. Oh, I know it's heavy, but you're going to make it. And stick that in there. And this is going to be so beautiful. Boom. Ah, look at all those backpack slots. Okay. Let's get this out of the way. Okay, that's that's what the doctor ordered right there. Um, <laughs> I queued up all the ones over here that that are available. Fishing, we're not gonna work on right now. We're I don't know. We're we're gonna work on transportation right now, because that's part of the challenge um, for the. <laughs> let's see, arms or shoes? I think shoes. Okay, we're gonna try it. I'm gonna reprogram the stone builder to use stones that come in wheelbarrows. I can't remember how to grab the wheelbarrows though. Control left click, take control, control right click, release control, okay. So eventually we'll have to change this so we have them park in really specific areas. If we're going to have more than one, at least. Um, control right click. Of course, this will be a little harder because, for one thing, I can't see. Okay, then you'll grab stones. Um, I don't know how much this holds. Okay, 20. So if we do until hands full, it holds 6. Until hands empty. I think it'll give it a full message at less than 20. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. So let's say 3 times. Okay, so the area that we want it to find the wheelbarrow in is over here. Um, probably need to narrow it in because we might use something wheelbarrow for logs. Doubt it. Um, find stone. Yeah, same here. There might be another crude wheelbarrow nearby. So we'll do this. Okay, then did it say pick it up? Okay, then walk over here, right here maybe. Uh, it's gonna be one short because this is gonna be until is it held object i don't think so i'll have to check yeah it's this until stone storage is empty ah not enough memory So, that's fine. I will make memory for these bots because I, uh, because it, it makes me happy to make memory. So, let's turn off one of these. And I think I'm gonna make the crappier memory, but I don't remember what it needs. But it might be four poles and four acorns, which I can now carry all at once. See, it won't let me take poles. Um, Probably because this goddamn thing is bugged. Oh, because I'm still holding this. Oh, okay. Okay. And then we'll have the stone builder grab stones out of that. But 
I'm gonna make two of them because, um, like, what does the stone builder do while that one's filling it up? Right? Is this the one I stopped? The one that's furthest away from me? Okay, it doesn't need the fancy one. Oh, good. So then I can go back to shoes and then turn that back on. Perfect. Except that I didn't pick up two. There. Okay, so you get that. And I think... Oh boy. I know my cold is... Uh, no. Okay. Okay, we're gonna try this. It's always an experiment, basically just to try and find something. We better name it first. Let's see. Stone Porter. Really, it's like a Carter. I don't know. What do you call him? Teamster? I don't know. <laughs> My knowledge of the world of work. <laughs> so what I'll have to do to make the other one work is put another wheelbarrow over here. Oh, it's not gonna work. It has to find the exact right one. Okay, stop. Um, so when it's find nearest crude wheelbarrow... Oh my god, okay. It's gotta find it right here. I can't tell where it stops and starts as far as the pixels go. And same. Because otherwise it'll pick up one that may or may not be full. So now I have to have it drop. Go. I should maybe wait and see if it actually functions before I do the other one. What do you think of that? Um, the other idea is for the planks and the logs. Um, we can have, instead of having this storage here, we can have just a porter, the teamster. Um, do that, do the same thing. Um, yeah, I'm gonna wait and see if it works. So in the meantime, how's our fence coming along? Okay. And our supplies look just fine, so we'll do this. Build, build more. And then I'll start putting in the fence around the chicken area. And then we'll look at what we need to make ponchos. Oh. And of course I figured out I need the spaceport in order to get access to all the different kinds of fencing because of our challenge to use different fencing. Here's where all my other fence went. And I built the spaceport while I was waiting for forestry to recover. And I forgot there's a little animation. So I'm sorry about that. So basically, like, Planet Altair needs chimneys. I am not going to make stuff like that. Yeah, it would add to the challenge, but I am not, I am only going to do easy things. That there's a limit to my insanity. Okay, clay pots we can do, and these other two I actually did already. So bulrush thread um, entices me because I've been wanting to set up that area to make thread and whatever else I need over there for a while. But we'll start with wool. So I need a bot to make wool. I mean to grab wool and put it in this. Oh, let's activate that job. Uh, of course I'm all over the place right here. 
So we'll do that in a second, but this seems to have worked. So... Oh crap, I just clicked in the wrong place. And set my little auto knot to run all over Timbuktu. Builders. Stone builder. Oh, it only does one. I was gonna have two wheelbarrows so we don't run into that problem, but um, while the wheelbarrow is moving, I wonder if it goes. I wonder, like, if the wheelbarrow's over here, will the stone builder come over here and grab it from that? That's the problem with until doing it until this thing is full or doing it three times. Um, okay, let's put in a gate like here, um, and in the middle, and then on the sides I guess I'll have a few less gates since I don't have enough. Like that, maybe. Um, so this way we can just stick chooks in here. They don't need anything other than dirt. Although they like cereal. Uh, okay. Oh, I already have enough. Okay, so I made a little bit of extra. That is totally fine. And our wands are ready so we can make bees and then I'll grab the chooks and stick them in there. And that's one thing done. Uh, okay, I need to turn off that one. And then I need both of these selected because I need to get them out of my way. I do not have good aim. Yes, I should be zooming in. I always talk about it. Okay, we don't want those anymore. We want some bees. Beehives, apparently, they just work better, but I haven't really tested it. Did I tell it to make the wrong amount, apparently? Or did I need an extra bee, an extra chook wand for something? I'm gonna not use it because I'm scared that I needed that wand. Oh wait, oh no, it's just a graphic glitch, like that. Oh, is this not closed? Okay, good. Okay, we have a chick. We have two chicks. So then once we get an egg, we can do the research that allows us to build the chicken coop and then that gives us another achievement. Yeah. Now we will see. If I have enough of this log stuff, it was going to be for here, but I need something here, so um, I guess I'll do something. I don't know if I have doors. Oh, I do. Oh, I have the amount that I like. Let's put in the doors first. It's just easier to see. I don't really need them to be symmetrical, but... This is probably going to be symmetrical, because it's just a symmetrical kind of day. I don't need them on the left at all, probably. But, what the heck. <laughs> so what I should be doing is probably making this two or three high. So that we have variety in our fencing, but... So that, um... But, you know, it's too bad, I guess. Oh, wow, I, it looks like I do have enough. Okay. This is for two reasons. So for toys, we need... Of course, we need the toy bench. 
And I think I'll make two because it seems like toy makers don't keep up. But their product is very, um, very difficult to make. So uh, then we need one of these because we need to make thread. So, oh wow, I have a lot of this sand, sandy track. And then the thread I put over here, but I guess I'll put it here, or maybe I'll even put it closer. And I thought about making, I mean the string. We need string to make thread. I thought about putting the thread maker in here, and maybe I will. We can always move it. But let's, um, I guess now that I have this, I can, let's see if it works. Let's build a house. So now the stone builder won't use the stone out of here, so it's less of a strain. When I build one of these houses, that takes 10 from each of these, so, and that comes out of here, but still, it should help a little. Um, so now maybe I'll make, well, you know what, we're focused on toys right now, so I guess I'll do that. Although the thought was, you know, it could be going while we're doing this. Hmm. It, it says it didn't use the wheelbarrow, even though... It used it. Do you have to take it out of here and put it into storage or something? Okay, we'll find out. So we probably need a bunch of bots with hands, which I made this one for, I can't remember what. But I'm sure it'll come back. Um, oh yeah, no. Maybe I only need one with hands. The toy maker will probably need memory. It'll probably need. I should probably just make a bot that makes memory chips. Uh, but until then, I definitely need to make a memory chip for the toy maker. So let me do that real quick. Okay, so I did that, but I need to put the backpacks on it, or this thing will start making stuff. Of course, I guess it won't because I need to turn it on. There we go. Um, yeah, let's see. I am going to need also a button maker, which is another reason I need poles in this area. Let's see. Wood shaping bench. Yeah. For now, you know, space isn't an issue in here, but we'll see what happens. Okay, I'm not sure if I have enough bots with the right parts, but we're gonna get started. No, we're not. When it comes to thread, I actually need storage. Which I'm out of. Okay. Okay, it's easier to build it from the top down. Okay, and what, what are- we're stuck on stone. Uh, why are we stuck on stone? You should be getting it from there. Um... Builder... Stone builder... Let's see, I'm just going to record taking it out of there to see what happens. It might be because it's like fine nearest... yeah. Okay, so we can put more than one crude wheelbarrow carrying stone over here. So yeah, which was my initial plan. Okay. Um, 
Okay, so when I did that, there was a star as if it had been used. Okay, oh, it's working. So we can do this. Nope. I know I said I was gonna focus on that, but... You guys know I'm a liar. Okay, find nearest crude wheelbarrow. Okay, so that other one is still wrong. It's gotta be here. Okay, the, the, no, it's not right. We need to move to here. Oh, I guess it was already there. Disengage. Um, find that stone over there. Then this one, we want to make sure it's just grabbing the right wheelbarrow. Which I don't know if it's in the front or the back of that wheel. And then picking up the right wheelbarrow. So now this one's gonna be broken once that's empty. I'll have to fix it. Oh. Okay. Yep. Definitely forgot where I was for a minute. Well, it looks like we need... I'm gonna make some more crates in a sec, so let's see. This crate goes here, I guess, for thread. And then let's make a few more crates. And so this looks okay. So let's make another one of these. I'm just gonna inch it along. Because we know this one's gonna break now, that one stone teamster. Oi. Where am I? Who am I? Nobody knows, but I'm pretty sure I need. Uh, uh, why do those bots have all that memory? Oh, to make toys. <laughs> if only there were a memory upgrade for me. That would be amazing. I want to move the straw over there too. This one's gonna make thread. So you'll just go here. So we need a thread maker, a thread storage, could be the same bot. Um, cause I don't know. I'll, I'll just make a separate storage bot. A Button maker, which the buttons we don't need to store, I don't think, because it makes several buttons. It makes a lot of thread too, but oops. Uh huh, none of this is right. And like so. Um, and it only takes one string to make a thread, so that's good. Um, not tread. That's the Irish way. And... So this is gonna put a strain on the weeds. Because string is made out of weeds. But, and just building up our initial thread supply is going to put quite a strain. And then once we've got it, it should be fine. Okay, so here we're making buttons. And then here, we're going to make a puppy. And the puppy has straw. So with straw, I'm thinking about doing the same thing as with... I'm th thinking about using a wheelbarrow. Let's see, so straw storage. 
Yeah. Wait, why is it not finding straw? Because we're not using cereal for anything. We are using it for this, except we're not using the crude dough right now. So it's okay. How much straw do I have? 60. Okay, I better be careful. It goes into the this, too. Um, so, okay. So I will, first of all, change the cereal harvester to be linked to straw storage for now instead of cereal so that we continue to produce straw and then um, I'm thinking so for this I was thinking of using a cart full of fixing pegs just like for the other so um, I need to program, so I'm going to need a couple more memories and I need um, to program the wheelbarrow to come over here and then I need to program a wheelbarrow to grab straw as well. Hey, there's a bot that's not upgraded. So that's important too. So I guess I will be making some more memory chips. It's kind of clear to me that I need a bot to make memory chips, don't I? So all of these bots here that made the upgrades are no longer needed. Um, except for like maybe for this last, you know, every once in a while I find a straggler, but I can just, you know, upgrade do the upgrade myself. And these workbenches are already loaded. So, you know, all I need to do now, since I upgraded that one's body, is to stick the drive on there and then the bot queues up the next one so it's ready to go, but that's not really needed. Um, so I guess we'll do probably a skip forward for this one. I'm turning this back on just because, just to kind of show you, like, this bot got messed up. The one, I forgot to, like, catch it when it was done, um, when this was empty. So then it was totally messed up with the other bot, too. So unfortunately, it's kind of cheating in a little way, because... All of that taking stuff out of the wheelbarrow I just did to reset it. What? What's this one now? <laughs> oh wait, is the other bot already done? Is that what's going on? Yeah. So this house just needs straw, which might be messed up now. Um, okay, so I didn't even get to making the memory things yet, but I'm having them upgrade another of these workbenches so that I can build a memory builder. So, um, let's see. Yeah. But for now, I just need the bad, the, I shouldn't say bad, it's a judgment. But I don't need the fancy memory for, fancy is a judgment too, by the way, um, for the wheelbarrow stuff so I'm just gonna go back and continue making that and skip ahead I just kind of wanted to show you what I, I feel like I want you guys to be a part of these achievements or whatever they turn out to be when they happen so I want you to see the kind of hiccups along the way well crap you guys I'm having all kinds of problems with my video camera um, and I just programmed a bot to cart planks over to here and um, we're waiting for it to fill up to see if it'll work but it looks like it's already broken uh, is it holding that wheelbarrow no okay did it one time. Our planks stuck. Sometimes a game glitches out. 
Um, oh yeah, one way to cheat is just to fill and unfill this over and over. But part of the challenge was to... Um... Oh, I know what it is. Oops. Part of the challenge was to use wheelbarrows and stuff. I gotta empty this out a little bit though, or else it'll be broken. So anyway, I programmed all of it incorrectly. Um, and then I was saying, I'm just gonna, you know, skip ahead to when I program the one for straw, but then it was broken, so... Okay. Um, so... But, uh, yeah. So, uh... Basically, to get them going, I have to put the cart where it is that I'm gonna want them to pick it up. Maybe for straw we'll do a crude cart instead of a wheelbarrow. Uh, you know what? No. I'll do that for the logs and stuff. And the... This isn't gonna need planks pretty soon, but... Um, so we're gonna need it to pick up a wheelbarrow over here. Um, over here. And then, the question is, do I have it take straw from here or from storage? Okay, so find the nearest crude wheelbarrow. So I programmed it. I figured it'd be easier to do it on the vertical instead of the horizontal. I'm pretty sure none of that video got recorded, so I'll just say it again. Because that way it's easier for me. Because I couldn't tell where it started and stopped on the vertical. So if I just have it... Like, this is the only one on in this vertical area, then um, it, it's easier to see where it is. Okay. But I have to also put in the movement. Move to... here? No, I think it's here. Okay. So first it'll move to here disengage and then where do we want it to drop off the straw that right now it's programmed to drop it off over in the toy area so um maybe to here this is where it was before and then once this straw thing is going oh I didn't program it to pick up straw oops um, then I can change the programming on the torch maker and on the straw builder. Oh look, we have eggs. Um, yeah, I forgot to. Um, yeah, I guess I'll have it take it out of here because this straw will stop being made once straw storage is full. So we'll just do that. Likewise with the plank one, I could have had it pick up planks from here, but it's the same issue. Okay. Yes, this one I could have just clicked on the storage instead of running over here. Okay, let's see what happens. Okay, this is ready, so let's try making a button maker. Yeah, that's big. Okay, so you're gonna find a wheelbarrow over here. Oh, I remembered. I finally remembered why I had made another bot with the arm upgrades. Until hands full. Then you'll come. Oh, crap, it's fixing pigs. <laughs> oh, man. Uh. Okay, you stop. So I'm gonna just have it come over here. <laughs> Is it any wonder I don't use carts? <laughs> uh, yeah, come over here. 
and I'll have it drop that and then I'll just I can just change this <laughs> or I guess I'll empty it out because I'm not gonna program it to empty it out which might make this this thing yeah we're already at 72 yeah <laughs> Very efficient though, it's working. If only it was carrying the right things. I do need one for planks <laughs> for the other area, but <laughs> okay. Oh uh, yeah. Peg. Peg. <laughs> Go. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> It's parking over here. You know what? I'm gonna leave it for now. <laughs> I had made a bot with arms so I could have it do the spaceport. Um, so we can do that while we're waiting. Or for the straw one, what's going on there? Okay. It should be picking it up and carrying it now. Okay, uh, is this wrong? How much is in there? How did it get filled and then slightly moved? Um, okay. Oh man. This is, this is so wonderful. It's really good. Really... Oh, it must have been pointing the wrong way. So I need this a little bit bigger. Because if it moves to here from the other direction... Yeah. But now... I don't know. Now I need to do something else, because... Now it's interrupted partway through its cycle here. So we need to have it now just go. Freaking thing. Ah! So now I need to put this stuff at the top so it goes because it's basically full. If I have it run this again it won't work. Okay. And our bot should find this straw right here. I'm not sure, so I'll just put it where it will definitely find it. Okay. I'm more concerned about getting toys, which I promised to do this episode, so I'm not going to worry about the straw. Okay. Take from crude wheelbarrow. We already got that. Uh -huh. Add to wood shaping bench until hands empty. Until the bench is full. Okay. Uh, go. Ugh, sitting in the wrong place. Oh yeah, because the bench is full now, so I'll pick those up. Why isn't it? Oh, I didn't turn it on. It should have still done it one time. I'm confused, but okay. I'm always confused. Um... Now, now, we can make a toy maker. <laughs> okay. So, toy maker. Let's just think about what we need. Four straw, three buttons. So it can take two thread, like this. So it only has to do two trips, I guess. One thread, stow. Um, find the straw. 
Uh, and it needs four of these, if I recall. Okay. We're gonna have puppies. Times four. And come back here. 21 kilobytes. Uh, toe hands empty. Okay, then two two blankets and three buttons. Okay, so so wool blankets. This is one reason why I definitely always make wool blanket storage or whatever blanket I'm making because more than just the ponchos use it, right? So take two of those and then stow. And then this is three times. <sighs> yeah, and actually I can just copy this here. So, I am gonna have, let's see. I am gonna have toy storage. And part of the reason is so that we build some up here at the beginning. Um, and so, like with the other stuff, so we have a little cushion. Um, and I just have to do that and then find that bot. That's the straw storage one. Don't know what that was. There it is. <laughs> uh, let's see if it actually works. Puppy. I don't want to say breeder because I want to think of it like a toy and animal breeding is not totally uh, ethical, so... Put all this crap away while it's doing that. See if it works. Okay, getting close. <laughs> I feel like I have to say something, but. Okay, we have a puppy! And we're gonna put these puppies in a crate. <laughs> oh. Um. And, uh, let's see, a bot with shoes is fine for that. So you're gonna grab a puppy. <laughs> and you're gonna drop it off. And... <laughs> Definitely they're toy puppies, not real puppies. <laughs> Okay, um, and it seemed to be working, so we can just, we can make another puppy maker here. Um, it's not really needed at the beginning, but maybe to keep up on puppies. <laughs> now, last thing we need, and this is getting to be a long episode, but I promised, is to make jumpers. It looks to me like that bot can have the shoe upgrade and the storage bot can also have the shoe upgrade. Now this one we didn't get to and that's fine. We can do that next time. And also off screen I might program the rest of the flower bots. Um, they're not really needed right now but... Uh, damn it. But... I, I mean, I need them eventually, and I don't need to do that on screen, I don't think. Unless I hear otherwise, I guess, from people. Um, okay, so we need thread, no, wool blanket, string, and poncho. 
Okay. Can do. I think. Yeah, I think he can do it. I just, I guess I wasn't 100% sure about the memory. Jumper, I didn't look, but... Okay, wait, let me see how much that takes. Four. Oh yeah, I, d I didn't give it the arms, so that should be fine. Okay. So we did a lot. Um, but now, look. The button maker can't make buttons because this guy is over here getting pegs or somewhere. Yeah. Which I still need to fix, but it's so slow. But I guess it's also slow for it to run all the way over here and get pegs, so... Um, we could make a peg storage as a buffer, so I might do that. Um, but yeah, in the meantime, uh, we'll just make some more bots. And... Um, I think, you know, that'll call it good. In the next episode we can make, set up somebody to deliver to the spaceport and also um, the bulrush processing so that we can make whatever the bulrush thing that the spaceport wanted, but also because we're going to need it eventually anyway. Um, and then off screen, yeah, I'll just copy this, um, each flower team, I'll just copy it to at least the chamomile and the aster. Next time, too, maybe we'll be able to do the coconuts. Um, and yeah, the straw storage, the straw porter is not working. So maybe I'll be able to find out why. Oh! I found out why. Until fixing pig storage empty. That's why. Okay. Is it going to pick up the cart and take it where we want it to go? Looks like it. How much is in the cart? Don't know. Alright, um... <laughs> There's always something. <laughs> in any case, thank you so much for watching. Like, share, subscribe. Let me know if uh, you'd like to see more or less of the programming or different things. I'm, I'm open to it, and um, I will see you in the next one.